Hi there. In this quick video I'm going to show you what to do when a partition shows the wrong size. As you can see there 99.5 gigabytes and if I come here 119.48 gigabytes. This is a BitLocker encrypted partition and something is fishy. I just cloned it and it's still uh, showing the size from the old partition although it should be bigger now and should be showing the bigger size but in here it doesn't also shows the correct size like mini tool partition wizard in disk management from windows so only in here we have the wrong size so i will give it a restart let's see if the restart will fix our issue or not nope uh, same wrong size so my best guess is I need to decrypt this drive before I can do anything to it so uh, where is BitLocker what uh, manage BitLocker so I will decrypt it deactivate BitLocker deactivate BitLocker and I'm going to let it do its thing it will take a good while and when it's finished I will give uh, the laptop another restart it seems that on an SSD the decryption is going much quicker than on a hard drive so it shouldn't take that long at all decryption completed but still wrong size so let's give this PC a reboot once again and uh, see what we get after the reboot hopefully the correct size if not mini tool partition wizard uh, probably will tell us the issue now nope still wrong size let's uh, start uh, mini tool partition wizard and see what it says and actually mini tool partition wizard was wrong <laughs> this is uh, a bit weird and interesting at the same time but uh, yeah at least now we have the correct value and i can re-encrypt that drive and basically be done with it and you can see the 20 gigs that are unallocated so basically somehow they were in here in the encrypted partition but were not used so what i could do now is uh, hmm move resize and I will make it I don't know 110 gigabytes and the rest of the remaining space move resize this one and oh not allowing me to do that ah because there are other partitions between them let's see can I move this one right here let me try and use the move resize come on and get this little partition right here and now again move resize and increase this partition to the max and this unallocated space should be gone and we have a bigger C drive and a bigger D drive and uh, no issues whatsoever anymore so there was something in there that was come on apply that was basically reporting uh, the size of the partition uh, wrong drive c is being used now so yep restart now and it will do this uh, in another ms dos environment or maybe it's based on windows or linux not really sure what environment it will boot into and it's beginning to do its thing could take a really long while because it's doing this in ms-dos which for many things it's quite slow but doesn't seem to be going that slow yeah we'll see we'll see just let it do its thing and be back when it's finished And it finished and seems to be rebooting once again so hopefully 
Yeah, it did the other partition. Now normally it should be booting into Windows and all should be good. Let's check. And we are done. So yeah, basically cloning partitions that are encrypted could mess up the uh, size that is displayed. In this case Windows was displaying the size properly, but uh, uh, disk management in Windows and uh, mini tool partition wizard basically all the partition and softwares were showing a wrong size but windows was displaying the correct size but then again we had unused space which about 20 gigabytes that uh, which we get got back that we got back so yeah in the end we are done and now we can re-enable uh, encryption uh, by activating bitlocker once again and uh, yeah, with a password, blah, 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 all the steps. Uh, I'm not going to, I, actually I could go into that. I can input my password, then it will give me a code that uh, I need to save somewhere, a text file on a USB drive or print it or whatever, uh, in case I ever forget the password to not lose my data. And then it will do the encryption itself and uh, that's about it. So, hope this video helps you, in which case, please give it a like. Check out my other videos and as always, see you in the next one.